Okay, here we are talking about your big break, how you can take your passion, turn it into a business, Absolutely. feel good about your life, make some money. Mm. Love it. That is what we're here. I mean, because here's the deal about what Mary and I do here at Mom's Town and what our community is about. We're not trying to be all things to all moms. We just we just know that we can't do that. It's not possible well, to be all things to all moms. I think we're doing what we are, who we are. We're an, it's, we're just sharing well, with you an extension. You know, it's just an extension of who we are. We're mom entrepreneurs. We're mothers we first, and we're entrepreneurs second. That's right. And that's what we. That's what we know. That's what we love. And, and we love to hang out with other mom entrepreneurs. Don't you love? I do. I, I'm always amazed I, at people's creativity. Seriously, because women come, and even within our network, because we have a network of local Mom's Town websites around the country that certainly if you're interested in being the Mom's Town mayor in your town, you can send an email to bigbreakatmomstown.com also and let us know what town you're in. But anyway, we have this network of Mom's Town mayors, and they're so savvy they're so creative, and mm -hmm. there are things that I'm learning about mares in our own network that I didn't even know. So it's just really great to find out their strengths and what their dreams are, and that's what we certainly invited. It's, this isn't a show about the, the network, of course, but we invite you to check out the Mom's Town Network. Right. But I just love it because Mom's, like you said, super creative. Yes. I'm, I'm, you know mm -hmm. when it's so funny because all the mom entrepreneurs – got their business idea because they became a mom. True. It's true. I was talking to a gal the other day. She's a mom of two, 22 months and like nine months, something crazy. And she's pregnant with her third. And she's got a full-blown bibs and burpee product business, organic, you know, the whole nine yards. Because she's in that. Because she's in that mode. That's what she's in, and she's loving it, and then she's monetizing it. Yep. I, I think it's so fun. So yes. we do have some tips for you okay. um, on how to continue your momentum, because this is what we know about um, being an entrepreneur. It's, it's hard. <laughs> because you're constantly interrupted with mom duties. Yeah, and it's hard to keep the momentum, especially if yes. you're working by yourself. So being inspired and being motivated and keeping that momentum going in the right direction can be really difficult. So the first one is, especially if you're working from home, is to, when you feel stuck, start writing. I know we kind of touched on this the last segment, right. how important it is when you put a pen to paper, but if you're feeling stuck, start writing because it also, it helps you kind of start getting things out. out of your system. It's a process. Because otherwise, we're just constantly, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, you know, it, try to remember your grocery list in your head. You know, we do that with all other areas of our lives. And so I love just dumping it down on paper. Well, that's a really good point. Because if you go Thank to the you. grocery store without, and every mom knows this, if you go to the grocery store without your list, you're going to forget, A, you're going to forget things, B, you're going to spend more than you anticipated because right. then all of a sudden you're just like, well, maybe I need that. I don't know. Well, let's just buy it just in case. I know. And, and you don't you really have a plan. I know. I've, I so have to like, make a list. You have to make a list. So. And I think you have to keep it in a journal. Your list has to oh, stay in a journal. I know. We're like combining our two I know. things that we love to do. I, I need to get past the legal pad. I have all, I have stacks of legal pads. Well, that's your journal. That's my journal. It's not a pretty little bound book. I, I use legal pads and I date them so I know when, you know, oh, this was 2009, you know, March, whatever. But I dump everything in it because if I carry it around in my head, I'll fall over. Yes. And I, I can't, well, I can't I, function. I can't get, you know, I get all cluttered. And here's the other thing that we do. And we do this just as moms and organizing, getting our kids organized. We know that this is one of the secrets to our success. Are you going to say? Getting organized. Yeah. But getting organized the night before. Oh. And really having a plan. What, what did you think I was Because I say? thought you were going to mention a calendar. Because, and oh. this is so funny. I carry a little calendar with me. It's just, you know, folds over. It's just a basic thing and it shows me month at a glance. Yeah. Heather has the biggest desk calendar you can find. Well, ba boom on her desk. Okay, but <laughs> it's not necessarily the biggest you can find because it's one of those standard I standard size calendars because and it's, when it's you're a, a mom, great tool. when you're a mom, you have to have it just really gets in my way when I'm driving. <laughs> 
kidding. <laughs> but it keeps the sun off the interior I of the use car it, when that's you right. park. I can start using it as my um, window <laughs> visor thing, you know, so that my hot my string wheel doesn't get too that's hot. That's funny. Yeah, but you, yours is funny because you have three boys in three sports or whatever it is, and Steve's calendar, your calendar, our show schedule. But that's why it has to be so appointments. big. Appointments. If I kept it on my Blackberry or oh. whatever it is, I would be like this. Well, cross-eyed. Somebody asked me, well, why don't you just write in your, you know, put everything down on your Blackberry? I said, are you kidding? Who can read it? I, I'm a 40-something woman. I, I need, I'm tired of tapping away. I would rather have everything written down the old-fashioned way with my trusty pencil. So know your nature. Are you a digital PDA kind of person that puts everything in this? And or God bless you if you if are. You are. I'm not. I'm not. I need so, a calendar. And I carry it with me everywhere. So driving down the road. Okay, where are we going next? <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Moms, we have to do that. So you have to. The bottom line is point. Get everything out of your brain as you can. Yes. Carry I even one of those, I call them detective notebooks that they flip up and you jot down notes real fast. I mean, even something like that. Throw it in your purse. Something. You capture thoughts, dreams, inspiration, task lists, grocery lists, appointments, whatever it is, in one place. Lessens the stress. It does lessen the stress. And simple, simple tip, and you hear it all the time from all the experts, and we're going to reiterate it because it's really important. You have to, oh, actually it's two. Okay, you have two. to exercise. Oh, my you got to get the blood moving. you got to move. And then also drinking water because most of us, and myself included, I have to consist, I always have to remind myself to drink water because most of us walk through life dehydrated. dehydrated. Well, okay. You finished my sentence again. I don't again. mean to do That's okay. that. It's, just... like, it's like you're my husband. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, I don't know. No, I, I uh, well, we, yeah, anyway. we think too much alike. <laughs> okay, water and also... I'm trying to be really good and just trying to get a little bit more sleep. Sleep is big. Oh, you know, it's important. Brain cells, the memory, the eyesight. We need the sleep to come on and water just to restore us a little bit. And we're down to the last 30 seconds of oh the my show. Gosh. I know it goes by fast. So finding an Ethel, finding a mentor, finding a buddy that you can talk to about your dreams. Please send all of your dreams to us at BigBreakItMoms.com. Yeah, we love to hear about them. We love to hear about how, what it is you're dreaming of. And also, be sure to go to our site, MomsTown.com. Sign up for our newsletter so you can stay in the know. Yes, when we have tips from our guests and also when we have our teleseminars, our 15-minute quarter-hour crunch yes. on a variety of topics. It's really exciting. Thank you for being with us on Momstown. Town.